Hello, how's it going? Hey, Rhea, how you doing? Oh, hold on, gotta make sure we get the... Uh, what song are you doing is this? We need to have lighthearted stuff. Let's have something else. Oop. Yeah, I've been doing well. Glad. Hope it was eventful in a good way. Hmm. Yeah, this this song's a bit more melancholy, perhaps. But yeah, hope you're having a good New Year's Eve. Yo, Om, what's up, man? <laughs> Glad to have you here, Om. Hope you're doing well. Hydrate, thank you. I've got water. Mm -mm -mm. Ah. And so, yeah, I mean, what's everybody up to? Just finished chatting with a friend. Very cool. Hope that was good. Hmm. Man, I don't know. Maybe I, maybe I should do more just chatting streams just to kind of get more into the rhythm of it, you know? Talk with your bestie? Very nice. Tell your bestie that I'm glad they're your bestie. Take this water off warm in here the weather was weird here like a couple days leading up to christmas like through christmas and a little after but like really cold like getting below zero uh below zero and stuff and then like the other day it was in like the 50s it's gonna be almost 60 next week and this is unusual for where i'm at Yeah, I was kind of thinking that I wanted to be a little bit better at promoting the stream earlier, but I don't know. Stuff came up. This is in the 20s, and oh, yeah. Like, a lot of places lost power. Uh, I actually lost power for, like, an hour last night for unknown reasons. I don't know. I heard that someone else it went out for just, like, a second. So... Kind of weird. Like, we don't normally lose power because of cold. And it wasn't even that cold. Like, all the snow's already gone. But see, yeah, the plan tonight is to... First, we'll chat for a little bit. Like, to see how everybody's doing. I'd like to play some Bioshock, probably. Um, and frankly, I'm up for kind of whatever. Like, if anyone has any suggestions... Oh, the music's making you depressed? Yeah, this song's a little... Oh, that's, that's an hour. That's the entire album. Here we go. Here's something upbeat. Oh, there we go. Oh, I was part of the best... Thank you, Rhea. You know what? Golf with friends? Yeah, honestly. I'd be up for doing some golf with you, dude. Maybe to see if anybody else is up for it. We can do like an hour or so of golf. We could do that. I'd like to maybe at least get half an hour of chatting and then maybe play some golf or whatever. Okay. Yeah, we'll, see. we'll see, we'll see how it goes. And I'm always, uh, I'd probably like to do some chatting right before New Year's, uh, like, midnight for me as well. Come around 6.30, okay. Yeah, we'll see what we're feeling. I'm up for a little golf, though, definitely. Um... But yeah, that's, uh... Oh, I'm sorry, Rhea. I, I honestly... Like, stuff like that comes to my mind as well. And I, I can't imagine what it's like dealing with that. Ah. Uh. And there's really nothing to say to make it feel any better. 
Yeah, I mean, having that community around you is very important to this. To when you lose someone like that. Yeah. I guess my only thought is to move forward. Because there's nowhere else to go other than forward. And sometimes you just need a distraction when something bad happens, you know? Very festive this song. Ugh. Yeah, exactly. Sometimes the absolute best music to talk about this kind of stuff too. Sometimes, like what you need You need to realize like it's it really cannot feasibly get worse in some way in order for things to finally get better, and to realize a lot of stuff. And yeah, I mean, it's like, and sometimes with that stuff, you just kind of need a distraction. Like, you're just playing a game, and whatever. Oh, well, that's good. Yeah, like, professional help is very good. And, uh, like, playing piano, that's excellent. Like, that's a very healthy thing. It's like to play an instrument like that. So I'm really glad that you're, that you're being proactive in managing your, uh, your feelings and stuff. Uh, maybe I feel in this song. Oh, here we go. All right. Hmm. Yeah, music has an incredible power to soothe. Like, whether it's you're listening to it or you're making it. Dancing and playing music? Are you gonna be the person that always brings the guitar to the party? Is that your goal? <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> the most loved and hated person at any party. The guitar. Can you imagine, like, a party of, like, six people doing that? Like, if you're the guitar guy, and then there are five other guitar guys, your goal? Yeah. You get the attention. Uh, it'll, it'll be a fight. A guitar guy fight. Maybe be the novelty of being the guitar girl. That'd be crazy. Guitar demon. Wasn't that like Dave Grohl in like uh, either a music video or in uh, Tenacious D, like the movie? Bear that plays instruments, yeah. Or it could be Wojtek, the Polish bear that uh, got like rank corporal in the army for moving ammo around. Based bear. I wonder if they ever taught him to maul a German. <laughs> Ooh. 
Now that, now that will get you a medal. <laughs> like, hold on. Let me, like, you guys know what I'm talking about, right? I hope I'm not only whimsical and mysterious to guys, but also slightly threatening. Yeah, that's... <laughs> All right, uh, Voitech the bear, here we go. That's a cat. That's a, okay, hold on. All right, here we go, here we go. Miscellaneous window. Browser. Hmm. You're a bear that would be. The oh, that's right. You are a bear. That, what does that make me think of? Like, there's something from Skit from something, some bit from, like, a cartoon or whatever, that there's a bear that everyone thinks is just a regular person, and if they ever find out that the bear is actually a bear, they'll probably kill it or whatever. What song even is this? Oh, it's from East. So, fun fact, uh, but not exactly the best background, um, hold on, I will also get myself out of the middle of it, and, where'd I go, here I am, where'd I go, here I am, why the heck is the background not there? There it is. Nope, wrong one. This one. There we are. The rainbow color ability. Rhea, are you a VTuber? If not, why aren't you? Sun bears, bears is human in a costume. Sun bears? I'll look that up in a second. So, yeah. Voitech. That's how it's pronounced. A Syrian brown bear as a young cub at a railway station in Iran by... It was bought by, like, the Polish Army Corps. Evacuated from the Soviet Union in order to provide uh, for his rations and transportation. Eventually enlisted off officially as a soldier, as a private. And eventually promoted to corporal. Corporal. Okay, you don't want to be discovered. I like your bit, though. That sounds fun. Also, shrink this down a tiny bit more. There we go. Yeah, this is the bear that, uh, transported ammo. This is World War II. Uh, during the Battle of Monte Cassino in Italy, 1944, Wojtek helped move crates of am uh, ammunition because of a... Because of celebrities, because of the Allied generals and statesmen after the war, he was mustered out of the Polish army and lived the rest of his life at, in uh, Edinburgh, Zoo. 
died at 21. Man, what a boss. Uh, look at this. <laughs> He's got a freaking shell. Dude, can I get this patch? Can I get this on, like, a jacket? That's incredible. Yeah, I don't think this guy had any kills. Sadly. That's... Dude. these monuments. This one's in Krakow. What a good bear. What a good soldier. Imperial Ward? Wow. He might be. Whoa, look at that guy. Look at that snob. This bear fought for freedom, the liberty of all Poles, and all oppressed peoples across the world. Uh, so also, uh, yeah, I know, he's so friendly. He's a good boy. I thank him for his service. Salute. Yeah, it took a while for them to actually gain real freedom. So, also, uh, Ohm, you can make him the king of Poland in Hearts of Iron 4. Not even kidding. Oh, I'm gonna, I'll find the wiki for you. Oh, also. iTunes. Where is my iTunes? There? There it is. But really quick. That's about for Wiki. Except cookies. Poland. Uh, let's see here. I think it's a monarchist branch. You can make him the actual king of Poland. <laughs> I'm in danger! Uh, um... Alright, let's see. Go to the focus tree... Oh, hold on. Uh, I know there's a way... Okay. Uh, okay. Why is he not listed? House of Romanov, House of Habsburg... Hmm. Sun bears. One second, one second. I want to find... I want to find the picture, at least. Vortech. Hearts of Iron 4. I don't know if ISP's ever done this. I don't know if he's ever made the bear the king of Poland. Because he's already done basically the same path, just without the bear. Oh yeah, there are videos. But, uh, yeah. Here it is. Bear. But to see spoilers... 
You can get Wojtek as King of Poland. Yeah. I wonder what his traits are. I wonder how long... Like, he died in 19... Something or other. No, this is not a mod. This is legit. Rule 5, got Anastasia. Denying all candidates twice. Triggered an event about Anastasia not being a real Romanov, which gives the option to either lose 100 political power or get Wojtek as king. The choice seems clear. Yeah, you can get the bear as the king. It's kind of incredible. All right, so now what, uh, we're looking up sun bears. Is this the opposite of a water bear? Sun bear? Is it one word? Like it's it's this this bear with a real big tongue, right? This guy? Yeah, it's like they use it to either get honey or the bees in the nest. Yeah, it's like they have very long arms. Very long four limbs for a bear. Normally, actually no, legs. They have very long legs for a bear, I think. Yeah. Are you a moon bear? So, a uh, serious question though, Rhea. Are you ever... Are you planning on... Yeah, look at that. The proportions are so weird. Don't look at that. Um, are, you, are you ever planning on streaming or something? Or are you just, uh, like... If I may ask, what are your plans? Because your, your, your lore seems fun. Look at this guy. Big old yawn. He's a silly guy. Is he even trying to act natural in a bear, uh, bear disguise? Like, he's a goofy guy. Look at this goofy dude. You're gonna stream again your human form. Okay. Alright, you know what? Shout out. You. I already follow you. I got a... Whenever you stream, let me know. There you go, you got a shout out. Go give Rhea a follow. That weird thing. As I, I might not always be able to make it because I, the schedules are difficult. But yeah, I will do my best. Hmm. Ah, the World Wrestling Federation. Alright. Well, it was kind of more of a whoop, less of a. You know, I ordered an arm for my microphone so that I can have it up closer to my mouth. I hope it actually shows up and didn't actually just get stolen at some point. That'd be pretty nice. Uh, cause I, I mean, I ordered it kind of during a busy time for shipping. 
Maybe about a week ago? Hopefully it'll happen. So, uh, do you know... Uh, do you know, uh... You know Lucky? Like, she is kind of a, a Care Bear design streamer. Like, a human Care Bear. Like, I think she has a cool look. She's cool. Uh, I haven't watched her in a while, because... I don't know, I'm not really into this. It's like, it sucks... Yeah, yeah, she's cool. It sucks when you like a streamer, but you don't like what they stream. I love this song. This song's great. It's like... She does a lot of, like, horror games or whatever, and those don't really interest me that much. You attack the Care Bears. You're... You're the opposite of a Care Bear. You're a... Fair Bear. Like, fear, but it rhymes. Now, you know what? This song slaps so much. It's getting pumped up. Good, dude. This song's just incredible, dude. Like, OC Remix had some jams, man. Justice. That, that's cool. Like, fighting games... Like, part of me likes the, likes the idea of playing fighting games, and then other, another part of me is kind of like, I don't know. Like, streaming them. Turn it back down. Facilitate better conversation. Like, they're always... They're, they're cool to me. Like, there are some times that I was really into, like, some fighting games. Like, I loved Tekken 3. I loved Soul Calibur 2. I think I beat most of Tekken 7? No. 5? Hold on. Which Tekken game do I own? Yeah, Tekken 5. I rented Tekken... I have a funny level 10 Joker. Is that like Max? How long is this? Is this... Okay. We can, we can listen to this one. So it'll be good. Like, there's... It's funny. Like, the... So Tekken 2 was one of the demos on a uh, like a PlayStation demo disc that I got, like PlayStation Magazine demo disc. Oh, your console broke. Oh, I'm sorry. So I played a little bit of Tekken 2. 
For some reason, they made that demo really easy. You can only play as like June and Le and uh, Lay. I got a new one. All right. Uh. So yeah, so I got Tekken 2. Like, no, actually, that's the kind of thing. I didn't get Tekken 2. I really enjoyed the demo for Tekken 2. Then eventually, I really wanted to get I really wanted to get the game. But for some reason, we could never find a copy. At least where my dad was looking, because I was a kid at this point. So instead, we eventually got a copy of Tekken 1 and then Tekken 3. But never Tekken 2. This is weird. And uh, I love Tekken 3. I beat that game with every character. I was never good at it, so I need to do a lot of jump kicks, you know. You know, fighting game fair. And then, like, probably a decade later, I rented Tekken 4. Oh, hugs. Hugs back at you. Uh, I rented Tekken 4. I'm pretty. I played that a lot as I rented it. Then I got Tekken 5, and I think I pl I beat the game as most characters. And that game, I think 4 was the most annoying. No, it was 5. The final boss or 5 is really annoying. Like. Junachi or whatever, Jirachi. Uh, Peihachi's father. Oh, me? Me, the sweetest person? Oh, thank you. I just, I try to be fun and kind to everyone that wants to come on by. Try and be as supportive as I can. Also, I have another- I have a question for you. How do you feel about this kind of bear? Hello. How about a water bear? Ugh. Your brother. You know this guy? Alright. Part of grade. Water bear or moss piglets? A phylum of eight-legged segmented micro animals. So not not a micro not a it's it's multicellular. And the boss of bar, yeah. I'm the Germans. Yeah, these things are weird. So a micro animal. A microscopic animal and organisms that exhibit animal like qualities. Microfauna are represented in the animal kingdom. Nematodes. All arthropods. Like smaller than bugs. Like your average bug. Like you get. You get like a bee. Oh, look at this cutie. Look at its, its fuzz. And there are things that are like minutely smaller than bees. Like, they are microscopic. The bees are massive. I know, bees are cute. And they don't sting you. Oh, look at the baby. Oh, they're squishy butts. Yeah, I mean, it's like, how do, how do bears feel about bees? What is this? Uh, now we're just looking at bugs. 
Bugs that are not pests. Ew. Are cool. And sometimes tasty. <laughs> like a shrimp. So yeah, it's crazy. It's so weird that there are like legitimate animals that are smaller than bugs. Microflora? Tiny plants? You know, multicellular organisms that are like microscopic. That's so weird. Protozoan. Man. Anyway. Ba -ba. Exactly. As long as they're not stingy and as long as they are gross, like land on poop and then land on your food, you know. These taste like cotton candy. Ooh. Smell like Jolly Ranchers. Oh, that's cotton candy Jolly Ranchers? Uh. So. It just kind of makes me think of. What, what was I even going to say? I lost it. I lost my mind. Oh, you've got special for us. Like, uh, I've got... Okay, no, I remember now. I remember now. So, like, there's just a spider that lives in, like, the corner of my bathroom. And I don't want to get rid of it because, you know, it, it, it eats the flies. So, uh, spiders are good, as long as they are not- oh. As long as they're not, uh... As long as they're not poisonous. I don't live in places with very many... ...dangerous animals- uh, dangerous spiders. Like, I, I just got a spider hanging out in the corner down there, no problem. Also, this is absolutely... ...the weird human... The human bear that, uh, that Ohm was kind of talking about. This guy. Them wonky proportions. What is this? <laughs> Uh-oh! There goes the camera team! Your cousin is better. Like, there were so many cool concepts, I feel, for VTubers that... that are, have not been touched upon well. Like, why, why not, like, a, a Soviet bear? Like, I think a lot of the ideas that I have are actually better for girls. Like, man, she's a... she's a hot bear chick. That's, like... A Soviet, like a Soviet, uh, like, military officer. But I actually had an idea, I don't know, this idea, it's probably a story that I want to write, so I don't think I actually want to hear it exactly, but it's, like, I, I want to see more, like, maybe historically based VTubers, which would be kind of cool. Like, if they're... Uh, fun fact, one of the ideas for, that I was considering running with as a VTuber was that I was the last Roman Emperor, like the last Western Roman Emperor, and that was just like, and I just slept for 1500 years. Uh, rainbow with candy flowers, fish that taste like chocolate. Ah. Okay, I got confused there. Your forest is rainbow with candy flowers. <laughs> are, are you just tripping acid 24 7? 
Do you believe in magic in a young bear's heart? The water is all the colors, man. Oh. So... Ugh. So yeah, that would have been interesting, like, if I had gone with a different sort of look, and just a different kind of feel for a VTuber. Like, it was kind of brought up when I was pitching ideas to my friends, like, uh, a friend of mine said that being the last Roman Emperor is kind of, it feels kind of niche, like people wouldn't really get it, and that's uh, kind of what I, uh, one of the things I went with. Oh, thank you. But one of the things that I, I kind of regret, or at very least want to change, was that I like I liked my the idea for my lore, that I am a psychic soldier, that I'm basically, like, I'm the anime protagonist that has psychic powers and fights monsters and stuff. And I want to... But I want to have a more visually interesting model. Like, let's play around here. Actually, hold on. Let's, it'd be easier to just do it this way. What? Like... I, I like the idea of just being like... I look like I'm just a dude, primarily. But I want to have a better... Welcome back! So, like, I want to have something a bit more... Eye-catching. Yeah, like a, a more interesting wardrobe. But we were just talking about micro animals and stuff. Really. Water bears as opposed to sun bears. Like... I should have been more... Like, I would love to get a, a redesign, like a, a new model that is more... Striking. Has more just like detail and stuff. I was hoping to kind of get a... Like a, a model... A new design kind of like sketched out, but uh, that did not. Uh, I'll, I'll need to find somebody that will help me with that. Uh, yeah, we'll do. Oh, I'll look harder for folks that I can uh, uh, help me design. Yeah, yeah, well, let's, let's go ahead and do, let's go ahead and do, um, do some golf. Uh, let's fire up the game here. Like, uh, the difficulty with, just with designing my model is that I had a hard time thinking of, like, a lot of specific things that I wanted. Yeah, I, I like the way that I look, but I could... But things could be better, is what I'm saying. Golf. Alright, Golf Club 2019 featuring PGA Tour. That's what we're talking about, right? <laughs> I gotta reinstall this. Like, there's always room to improve, and part of that improvement could be a new model. There's a pizza party pack. So, Rhea, uh, do you have golf with your friends? If you're interested, would you like to do some golf? Totally cool if you're not interested, though. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Alright, we're probably not going to be golfing for too long, though. Unless somebody else pops in and is like, hey, let's golf. Golf, golf, golf. 
Now scare a golf there. Now scare a golf. Golf, golf, golf. Get a different song. All right, here we go. Here we go. Both of Good Friends is a fun little game. Oh, also, oh, uh, did you by any chance upload your VOD of Stellaris that we streamed earlier? Because I want to make a playlist of as many, uh, like, of the other perspectives that I do of golf, you know? I'm not even golf. Of multi When other people that I do multiplayer streams with... I would like to get as many perspectives as I can. You got a brain, you need. Yeah. You'll be golfing with friends is in in spirit. Spiritual golf. You do. Okay. Yeah. Just um, send me the link when, whenever, and I will put it in the playlist. Oh, we can we can talk in Discord. But once I get the game set up and everything, uh, we will we'll hop in. We'll we'll jump into the Discord chat or something. Uh, we could probably just go into the stream number one in my Discord. Won't have to bother with the chat or anything. You can speak four languages, like IRL? Or how many of them are bear language? Final Fantasy XIV Summoner. Nice. Yeah, it's like uh, bear, English... Spanish and Korean. Nice. Also, I just realized how many people in like the general chat just reacted with random emotes, like mostly void. <laughs> this guy. So I'm curious though, like, uh, how did you go about learning Spanish and Korean? Well, we'll use stream. You just hop into the stream chat whenever you're ready. Uh, the, the stream... Uh, yeah. Taught yourself Korean, wow. Like, uh, isn't the, the alphabet is actually rather easy, because it has... Like a letter for every basic every like syllable basically. And he studied uh studied Spanish in high school. Cool. Alright, looks like that is done. Alright. Go ahead and pause the music. Let's uh bring in golf. Hard but really easy. Okay. Like, it's weird how some languages are just easier for people. Like, I, when I hear about people that, when it comes to, like, studying, like, the Bible, like, some people have an easier time learning 
Hebrew if they are more like almost artistic and then other people have a better time learning the Greek if they're more more logically focused. You know what I mean? Golf with your friends. Get that millennial uh Uh, get that fancy millennial, uh, uh, xylophone music on here. But yeah, I, I, I've, I studied Spanish throughout, basically, little bits here and there, elementary school and middle school, took it in high school, and then, like, a semester in college, and then by the time I got to my second semester, I was like, this is way more difficult than I actually cared I would do, so I ended up taking... Two semesters of American Sign Language. Which was interesting. That was it was cool. Alright, anyway. Let's switch on over to golf. Wow, you the French and a bit of Irish, really, like Celtic. And Ukrainian, wow. And German you're just all over the place with languages. If, if there is any one language I'd like to learn, I think it would be German. Because I think grammatically it's it's pretty easy for English speakers. And, uh... Like, uh, I am ethnically German. Or at least more than most things. My most recent ancestor uh, came to the U.S. from Germany. And I kind of like to lean into it a little bit. I don't know. Look at this. 14. Wow. Teaching yourself. That's... Wow. Wow. 